I'm Marshall William Cyber from the United States Marshal Service. Uh, I want to give you a little bit of information of uh, what occurred this morning and be brief. We have family members that are, of the U.S. Marshals that are en route, so we owe it to them uh, to talk to them first. Um, here's what I can tell you at the present time. Around 6.45 uh, this morning, uh, the U.S. Marshals and the city police officer were attempting to uh, take a suspect into custody at 31 block of uh, Osage. When the suspect fired, our guys returned fired, and the suspect is deceased. Um, when Marshall was in critical condition, uh, with a gunshot wound to the head. Uh, one is, uh, has a wound to the ankle and expected to be okay. Uh, the city officer was grazed in the face and, and expected to be okay also. Uh, again, we still have family members uh, that are trying to make their way here. Uh, the information we have, uh, we'll get it first. Um, we release additional information uh, later on. So, any other questions? Uh, uh, the chief is here, the mayor. Um, that's all I have to say. Can you tell us the nature of what they were trying to do this morning? Uh, I have no questions. Chief, can you give us a statement, please? What was going on this morning? So, certainly, uh, our hearts and thoughts and prayers go out to the officers and their family members right now. Um, we don't have all the details, as you might imagine. Um, it's still under investigation. Right now, we're just uh, praying for uh, the officers who are injured and hopefully that uh, everything works out well. What can you tell us about the St. Louis police officer that was involved in this? The St. Louis police officer uh, was grazed. Um, we, one of the shots struck his bulletproof vest. Um, he is not in serious condition. Uh, he will recover. He's still in the hospital now. We're hoping that he'll be released today. Can you tell us heard that the, the suspect had vowed not to be taken alive. Do you have any prior knowledge that this would be a difficult arrest? Well, we don't want to give any information relative to that right now. As I said, um, in the beginning stages of any investigation, um, the details are sketchy, and so we want to be sure that we get the proper information. So that's all we would have. Can you tell us the name of the officer? Mayor, can you, Mayor, what can you tell us about what happened today? What I will say is, first of all, you heard from the, uh, from the U.S. Marshal and the Chief in terms of the you know, what, what they can tell you about the condition of the officers and what happened. What I will say is to the people of St. Louis that this is a tragic example of what our law enforcement officers uh, go through, the risks they undertake, and their families. And, uh, so we need, to, we need to support them, we need to think about them, and for the injured officers, we need to be